um, traditionally when done discussing um, counseling theories, you usually look at the counseling theories that are the foundation. And the foundation of them are created by um, white men. You look at uh, psychoanalytic, uh, Adlerian, behaviorism, cognitive behaviorism, um, REBT, uh, person-centered, and so forth, right? And a lot of therapists and counselors, you know, adapt these theories to the extent to where, like, they look at it as universal. But the interesting thing is, is it really universal? When you have clients of color, as I you know, black, Latino, uh, Asian, uh, indigenous populations, should you really have counselors afraid to look outside the box and look at theories that are not formulated by white males? That's one of the reasons that I look at an African-centered Afrofuturistic approach to therapeutic process to where it looks more into the social construct of race and how that impacts the person, uh, their dynamics of how they define themselves, um, their spiritual connection, their connection with the universe, um, kind of like a liberation type deal where they don't feel forced to assimilate. So these are some of the things I look at is when I look at in a, the therapeutic process and establishing that relationship. You've got to be able to understand your client on where they're coming from and the things that their culture brings to the table.